how can I start a grocer business with small capital? You will start with small capital if you follow my techniques. Not every thing needed in a grocer you should bring them. You have to be specific. I'm Kodi Mukasa Joseph by the names on my YouTube channel, Facebook, TikTok, always the same name, Mukasa Joseph Yugi. Today we have come here to dissect how someone can start a um, grocery business with a cent a katono. People that will ask, how much do I need to start with? A grocer. If somebody has like 10 million, you can start a grocer. But you have to be based on the things people they need in their daily life. That's the point where it is. If you are new here right now, recently to my video, it was the first time to listen on my video. Just click the notification bell there down. It is black in the color. Hit it. So, you'll be following me whenever I upload the new video. So, most people, they have money, but they don't know how, what, they don't know what they are going to use with their money. People, they are fidgeting, they do not decide what to, they are going to do. They need to start businesses, they have the money, but especially they do not know where to start from. So, this goes to a person who needs to start a business with 10 millions you can start okay so in this what steps are you going to look for at the first moment as usual we tell people if you're starting the business you have to do one thing you have to look where your market is going to be you have to look the place which will sell your business you have to look to the place where the business should have location. In consideration, it is called location. Where your business is going to start. Those are the things mostly people forget to know about the location. They are just after, I have my money, I will go anywhere to start the business. It is wrong. My dear friend, it is wrong. Location, it's very important when you are starting this business. Then number two, because you are going into businesses with the suppliers, you need to have a business name. Every day we talk about that. You need to have a business name. Number three, if you are going to start a grocery business, you may need a loan. You may, the, pro, uh, the product may need demand from the population of the people or from the buyers so, you will acquire a loan in the bank. Make sure, make sure you have registered your business. In Uganda, you go where supposed to register your business. It's not expensive. So, you will be able to acquire a loan. Don't forget that you need to have a uh, before you start, you need to have to know how your marketing strategy is going to be. It's very important. In this grocery business, we are going to target these grain foods, potion, millet, like those ones. We are sugar. So exactly we have to look to the people of schools, those people who need that one. You go, you contact them physically. You tell them, so I'll take a percentage from you if you take this amount. Okay. Then you need a bank account, a telephone number, a telephone cell. So let me start. In this business, it is profitable if you understand the game, how it's being played. How you are going to play the game. You have to be strategic. So what do you need? The number one, you have to think of the items Mostly people they need in their daily life. Like what? Like sugar. Bring sugar in 
in numbers. Like, let me talk about if you can bring like 500 kg, like 1 kg, it depends to your capital which you have. You know, mostly in my motherland, Uganda, people, they prefer buying where there are variety of items and they are in large numbers. Most people, they prefer thinking that those people, they are, uh, uh, um, those people, they are the right people having the good, right products. You have to be, let me start, I think, like uh, with uh, one ton for sugar. Number two, look for posho. Posho, mostly schools need posho. Okay, so if we go to the marketing strategy, posho, you have to look for those schools. Most schools, they do not have money. Sometimes you have to give them food or posho, beans. You may be the supplier. You make an agreement how the payment will be. Okay, think about rice because mostly people now they are eating posho rice. Those are the things we need in large amount. Just to think that with your less capital you have, okay, you bring one ton for sugar, one ton for posho, one ton beans, okay, one ton. Uh, cooking uh, 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 gel cans of cooking oil, then wheat because now people they are depending on Kikomando, the economy is becoming worth people they are being fed on the Kikomando. People they understand the Kikomando, the chapati they put on beans, so it's the market will be there. So, merit rice, we already talked about that. So, people, if you space you, uh, you, th you think of the items of food people they need okay you will know how you can target your market you will know how you will target you will know how to target the market make sure that if you go into the business of the grocer make sure you target those things don't bring things which are not on demand Wait, people, you see how the demand of the customers, which type of uh, food product they need, is what you have to bring into your grocer. Into your grocer. A hundred percent, I'm quite sure you'll get good money. Don't forget, you have to market yourself. I always say, use your social media handles to market yourself. Use yourself, use your social media handles to market yourself. Make sure you give products. Sorry, you, you give uh, 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 you give good price to your customers. So in this, if you reach at the uh, extent of having a big grocer, you can look for those people who suppliers. You go to Kakla Sugar. You ask them to supply you. They will give you at a discount. You will go to uh, like a, uh, a rice, you look somewhere to supply you, he'll give you on discount. So people, don't jump into loans before you start the business. I always tell people, don't jump into loans before you start. Go into loan, despite the fact when there is demand for an item. I'm Kwadi Mkasa Joseph by Yugi. Greetings to all people who watches my videos, people in Saudi Arabia, UAE, Uganda, Canada. There are several people who are watching because I always monitor people who are watching my YouTube channel. I love you, everybody. Please try to watch this video. Try to watch this video. And you know where you need to start. God bless you.